Hi, my name is Dick Ensing. I'm a Tennessee artist. Today you're going to get a free lesson. I'm going to take you through the mechanics of painting. But before we start, I'm going to put a little bit of the uh, gloves in a bottle on. And this protects your hands. You rub it in and it protects your hands against oils, against the turps. And when you go to wash up, you won't have a bit of paint on your hands. Pick out three points of your subject. Let's pick out a point. Let's pick out right at the top of her head there. Let's pick out a point right here at the edge of, edge of her shoulder, right here. I'm going to pick out a point right there, one right here. And let's pick out another one at the edge of her shoulder there. And I'm going to show you why. You just put a little point there. Put a little point right here. Put a little point right here. Okay. Then very lightly, very lightly, draw a line to it. And it forms a triangular shape. Don't worry about this line, it's going to disappear too. Okay. What this does for you is watch. If I hold my brush, remember the planes we talked about? I hold my brush from this point to this point. I can see everything on that side of the the uh, subject, and I can see everything on this side of the subject. Watch. See? That point was here, point was there, everything on this side. So I know that that part of the hat's on this side. If I hold it over here from there to that part of it, this part here, her eye comes almost right down the middle of that. Sure enough, see? And here again, when you hold it this way, this way, I know everything's down this way and everything's up that way. It helps you draw things and relate things, relate things in planes. Planes are so important when you get into this.